And what is up guys, Dark Osina here. Welcoming y'all back to another installment of our video series. Welcome to the Council. Now this is a uh, narrative based game, which is something I'm a huge fan of. Uh, basically all your decisions and everything that you do within the game will affect the game later on for those who aren't aware. There's not a lot of action, just basically what the story narrative brings, so there can be some action, there can be some elements of, you know, shooting and gunplay, but mainly the whole premise of the story is derivative around the story. Now, I don't know too much about the story, except for, from what I've read, is that it's set in a secret society, um, and the secret society is based around that, and the fact that also you are... Uh, trying to solve a murder mystery about your mother. But without further ado, and enough of my rambling about this game, let's dive right into this. Let us see what happens. So I was able to set up most of the things. Um, graphically, it looks stunning. So Paris, France, December 10th of 1997. <laughs> Forgive me. 1792. These two? Well, that was uncalled for. You're not getting anywhere with this von Borschert. You know, I kind of get the same feeling, my dear Sarah. Listen. Oh dear, what are we listening for? Nothing. Not a sound. No one's coming to save you. <laughs> as far as you know. you think. The Golden Order knows exactly where we are. <laughs> Do they? Do they really? By the time your ridiculous secret society turns up, I'll be long gone. As for you, nothing will remain of your body. Well, if you touch a single hair on my mother's head, I'll skin you alive. Jesus Christ, dude, you need to work on that voice no, acting. No, Louis. I have no intention of beating your dear mother. Louis. There are more persuasive ways of making you talk. Oh? Truth You've serum? You've stolen really? something from me that I intend to get back. Where have you hidden it? I don't know. Von Where Borchardt. have we? You can't sell that book on the black market anymore. This is finished. We know you're planning on selling it at one of Lord Mortimer's parties. All right? Just tell us who the buyer is and we can make a deal. You've no idea of the trouble you've gotten yourselves into. Did we really? Oh, but you will tell me where it's hidden. I can promise you that. Ugh. Ugh. Stop annoying our host, Louis. Son, didn't what happened to you in Rome teach you anything? What'd you do in Rome? Just a few more minutes and my concoction will be ready. His concoction, my dear friends. His concoction. This, your bodies will dissolve in less than four hours. Phew. You'll see. Less than four, guys. No time. You know, I have to admit, Mother, the only thing you've ever taught me is that damn motto of yours. Oh, oh, oh. Always remain Naughty rational. Words. And open. I got it. I've opened the shackles. Draw him over here. I'll take care of him. Von Borchardt. Von Borchardt. Mm -hmm. Listen. Let's make a deal. A deal? Oh boy, deals. I'll tell you where the book is if you let my mother go free. Oh, what are you playing at? Don't worry, mother. You want to play the hero. Pity you're not in any position to do so. Or am the I? last time. Where is Alazif? Let me Act. Do this. Or trust her. Uh, you know what? Mother knows best. Please, be my guest, Mother. Aha! Mm. Uh -huh. <laughs> my, how the tables have turned! Are, are you going to... Aha! Uh -huh. Well done, Louis. You reacted perfectly. Excellent. How do you feel, Mother? Couldn't be better. He's alive. So I can question him after we get back. Okay. 
Pity he's just a middleman. Hmm. Means I haven't finished with this case. Oh, I had a feeling you'd be running off on one of your adventures again, Mother. You know what? I'm warning you. This time, I'm coming with you. No. Even though you impress me more and more, I have to do this on my own. Do you? Mother, you're no spring chicken anymore. Come on, let's go. Oh my. And don't forget to send our men to tend to Von Borchardt. It straight up looked like he was like looking at me like, Motherfucker, I'm gonna get you later. <laughs> like, he had this timber in his eyes like, What's up, bitch? Oh, uh, ding, 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 ding. One month later. Lord Mortimer's Island, off the coast of England. So we were in Paris, France before, but now we're off the coast of England. Focus Home and Interactive and S Cyanide Presents. A game by Big Bad Wolf Studios. So big shout out and thank you to them for bringing us this, this uh, game so far. I'm very intrigued to see what happens well done, here tonight. You just had to pick up Von Bertrand's trail on your own, didn't you? You ditch me in Paris with no explanation, and off you go to infiltrate one of the world-renowned receptions of this Lord Mortimer. And now he writes me to say that you've gone missing on his private island? Which, by the way, looks more like a big rock than a paradise island. And no argument for me here. But oh dear, Mama has gone me in episode one, the bad ones. Have we gone mad here today, Alice? The least he could do is explain to me how he managed to lose you. In any case, it is time for you to stop all this, Mother. It no longer suits your age. Well, I'm sure I'll find you once again, slogging through the caves beneath the island, searching for some long-lost nice. mystical object that you just can't live without. <laughs> I'm already hating this trip, and all I've done is okay. think about it. <laughs> Contrary to what one may be able to imagine, uh, his voice acting has improved. Well now, Duchess, we find ourselves both invited by Sir Hall. Well, how very amusing. Perhaps we have some common interests, Your Eminence. Is this your first time at one of Lord Mortimer's legendary parties? Oh, no. We have been friends since long ago. But as I'm doing some business with Sir Hall, the invitation came from him. Oh, dear. Well, I simply can't wait for all the festivities to begin. And you, good sir, what brings you here? Um. Hmm. Business. Lord Mortimer asked me to join him. We have some business to take care of. Oh, how mysterious. You adapt quickly, my son. You get along here like a fish in water. Good. What do you believe? That we are all here hoping to solve our personal issues? You'll see. Right. I doubt that you came here to look for your mother, your eminence. Anyway, consider Indeed. yourself fortunate, young man, because there are many who dream of simply one day setting foot on this island, and only a very few ever make it. Indeed, I imagine this must be your first time here. Interesting. Sure, That's right. we'll play along Until for now, a little bit. I've never been invited by Lord Mortimer. You'll see. You won't soon forget it. Given what I've seen so far, I wish I'd been passed over. Don't want to draw too much attention. They're waiting for us. We're moving, Monsieur de Richet, if you would like to join us. I'm coming, Duchess. A cardinal? A duchess? I wonder if all the guests here are this prestigious. If I'd known, I, I would have gone for a better suit. <laughs> uh, yeah, man. Huh? Are you right? Oh, did I do that? I didn't mean to startle him. Uh, oh dear. Uh, uh, is this something we'll have to deal with? He's freaking out. Whoa, fam. Whoa. Mother? Oh shit, your hand. Oh my gosh. So? Okay, it's done. Did you put it in a safe place? Yes. 
I made sure no one was following me. Don't worry, Sarah, no one's going to find it. Are you absolutely sure? Yes, I'm sure. I have so many questions. Right. Just one thing left to no, do. No, mother, don't, don't! What? Have you lost your mind? There's no other way. If you, if you kill me, you won't find it. That is the point, my dear. No one must ever put their hands on it again. No. But I trusted you. No, Sarah. Don't. No. Oh, dear. No! <gasps> you can run if you want to, Sarah. But you will pay You. Uh, Louis, are you alright? What's going on? Yes, I would like to know the very same question, my dear. Here, take this. I'm sorry. Keep it. Are you better? I'm fine. Don't worry. Interesting. It's getting late. Why don't why don't you just go on ahead and I'll catch up with you, okay? Are you sure? Well, yes. you're swallowing on and I'm sorry. I'm sure, yes. And ladies. Fine. I definitely have to find Mother quickly. Yes. Am I going crazy or, or what? This can't be real. The, the Duchess arrived with me. What's happening to me, for God's sake? I absolutely need to find you, Mother. Alright, can't interact with some of the letters, but we'll see. So this was the boat that we came from. Forgive me, I'm, all, I'm honestly using mouse and keyboard. I was hoping that it'd be a lot more sufficient. I'm getting back to the control schemes of mouse and keyboard, so if I seem a little shaky can, that's why, so. Uh, we could, uh, I don't think anything here we can interact with. Is there a shift? Yes, there is a spring. Excellent. So anyways, lots to discuss there. Uh, so we've got a got to figure out why his mother's hand spontaneously went missing, and why she wants to kill him. I know that the missing object has got to be the book, but why would she want to kill the Duchess? And what secret does she hold the whereabouts of the book? So many questions. Louis, during the trip, I had something I wanted to ask you, but we didn't happen to run into each other. Yes, Duchess. I'm not sure if you remember, but we've met before. At that time, you were of two minds as to your choice of career. Tell me, what have you been up to since? Choose your class. Uh, you could be a diplomat. Diplomat shines in society, a talents. Okay. Uh... Oh. Shines in society, a talented speaker, he avoids ex, ex pass, and he can convince those whom he is talking without offending them. Once it's revealed, the occultist is a master of deception, convincing of, convinced of the importance of knowledge he has the acquired extensive arts using others to achieve his own end. Does not bother him. Or the detective. The detective excels in the investigation. Brayton knows every detail in the surroundings as well as the question hands on men. Does not shy away. I'm leaning more towards. I'm not very big into the diplomat. Uh, maybe the occult or the detective. I might do another playthrough where we'll do the occult. But for right now, I think I'll stick with the detective work. And then we can kind of focus. So apparently, you can choose between skill not acquired so you can be able to acquire skills later interesting so anyways um logic use your logical mind read people's behaviors that would be actually very useful we should be able to do that very quickly uh vigilance notice noteworthy details and ordinary placed elements will also do that I will also put some to the logical mind, and I think that is all that we can do for right now. So, remove all points. I think that is how we're going to do that. Well, 
Over the last few years, I solved a number of crime cases, like the chauffeur d'orgère, for example. Thieves that tortured their victims with burning embers. Hmm, Interesting. Charming. How did you catch them? I told the most cowardly one that the others had given him up. Ah, and I wager your thief suddenly started to talk. You wouldn't believe it. He told us everything. The jobs, the stashes, the names of his partners. Couldn't shut him up. I heard about that case, but I didn't know you were the one who solved it. Mm, I'm flattered that the news made it across the channel. And you've got a darn good memory, Duchess. Well, they say I have the memory of two people. But please, call me Emily. Fine, Emily. Tell me, I was actually Emily. helped on that case by my mother. You wouldn't know her by any chance. Wait, Louis. We've already met. You do remember me, don't you? So of course she already knows. Not at all, so lie to her. Now I don't lie wait. Do we do we lie to her? Don't Please lie. excuse me, madam. I'm sure we've met before, but I don't remember where. Hmm. I appreciate your honesty, even if it's not very flattering for me. I imagine that with your beauty, madam. It's the first time a man hasn't remembered your face. Well, I must Lager. say, you make up for yourself rather elegantly. Please stop torturing me. I'm completely at your mercy. <laughs> Where have we met? Four years ago, in London? No, sorry. I don't remember. In the office of William Pitt. Remember? No? I am so sorry, Emily, but I really don't remember you. Let's drop it, Louis. It doesn't matter. Right, time to go to the manor. I concur. Opportunities. Your skills allow you to discover hidden details. Select the objects that is most suggestive of the situation or discovered it. Hey. Validate I her ask look. her a question, she answers with another. Is she playing with me? Variable revealed. Immunity review. Personalities. Each person you meet on the island has th their own personalities, which makes them vulnerable to certain skills and immune to others. Exploiting their personalities is crucial to achieve your personality goals skills using against Immunities will not succeed and leave you exhausted. Meanwhile, exploiting variables will give you one effort. Interesting. Emily, please excuse my insisting, but you still haven't answered about my mother. Do you know her? You'll see, Louis. Everybody here knows Sarah de Richet. I don't know where we're going like this, Emily, but you're connected to my mother one way or another. And if I can believe my vision, you don't have much of a place in her heart. This be true. Certain actions remember to review their unlocked conditions as effects. Alright, so how do we check our, our talents? Alright, there we are. That's how we can check our talents. Switch between Q and A, and then we can have different talents. So, Diplomatic Master, Occultist Master. And we're obviously heading straight for that. So each of these different talent trees, that we can obviously go for that. All right. Fun facts of the day, kids. Keep an eye out for certain things, and each thing. So these are the different characters. Immunity is logic. Alrighty. Well then, ladies and gentlemen, now that we've understand that type of mentality, I did see a few glowing objects, so I wanted to take a look. Well, uh, restore us two effort points. Carry no more than five. Honey, I couldn't have hoped for better. Must be an incredible view from up there. Impossible Indeed. to set foot on the island without being seen from 300 meters away. I thought I saw something else around here somewhere, but I'm not entirely too sure. 
checking other areas, so forgive me, but we're just gonna check other areas and see what we can get from here. Uh, Good evening, sir. May I ask your name, please? Louis Moraz de Richet. Monsieur de Richet, delighted to welcome you among us, sir. You must delighted be Sarah de Richet's son. I must tell you we are doing our utmost to find your mother as quickly as possible. You know. What can you tell me about the disappearance of my mother? Two weeks have passed since Sir's mother went missing. All the staff here have since been busy searching every nook and cranny of the island. But Sir may rest assured we shouldn't be long in finding her. And just what have you found so far? It would seem that Sir's mother may be hiding on the island and regularly changing her location. But huh. no one seems to know why she would find this behavior necessary. What do you mean? On several occasions, we have found leftovers of food, a few of her things, or even traces of campsites. The reason why we are searching the wharf again is because lights were spotted there last night. Where we are now? Indeed, sir. According to our information, lights were seen in the middle of the night, sir. After verification, none of the guests seem to have left the manor last night. We think that perhaps sir's mother was here. Skills. Your skills give you access to unique choices that in actions at the cost of effort points. By your skill level, or the cost of the effort points. Interesting. And did you find anything then? We discovered a certain amount of damage sir, Excellent. on the wooden part of the wharf. What type of damage? Broken barrels, mainly. We'll do whatever is necessary to have them rapidly repaired. But quite frankly, I can't imagine what Sir's mother would have been doing with them. What could Mother have been doing with barrels? Nevertheless, hiding. our search of the wharf hasn't been entirely unsuccessful, though. What are you hiding objects? We seem to have found an object that would appear to belong ah. to Sir's mother. A handkerchief. The handkerchief is embroidered with the initials S.D.R. We came to the conclusion that they are the initials of Sir's mother, Sarah de Richet. I have orders to give it to Lord Mortimer as soon as I see him. I know my mother. She's not the kind to go for a midnight stroll on the wharf for nothing. I've got to find out what the hell she was doing here. Where exactly Indeed. did you find the handkerchief? On the landing dock, sir. The one you arrived by. Alright, so I cannot ask, ask these sorts of questions, but perhaps... This give one. me the handkerchief. I'll personally show it to Lord Mortimer. Well... I've traveled hard for several days in order to get here. Yes, but... Invited by your master. No, of course, but... Because my mother went missing right under your nose. Sir, <laughs> And having only just arrived, you refused to give me her personal belongings? Of course not, sir. It was never my intention to contradict, sir. Here you are. I must return now. It is still much to prepare in order to welcome all the guests. Excellent. It is indeed your handkerchief, Mother. You must have come here for a specific reason. I need to know what it is. Interesting. Well, I probably what pissed him off. What are doing out here on this wharf? Servants. All right, so how many... How do I check to see how many more of my... This chest might belong to Duchess Hillsborough. So you can... You can move faster with the left... The right click. The way I'm getting in there, I don't think. In the game? Locked. I'll never get it open barehanded. I don't have a lot picking skill. I have to obtain that for later. Hold on. Blue. Aha! Or the royal jelly? A wooden floorboard.
probably comes from this part of the wharf. The wood is slightly eaten away, of course, but it still would have been fine if it weren't smashed. Okay, so let's question where it came from. of the wood, this floorboard has been ripped up. Yet it was in decent condition. I wonder why someone ripped it up. What's the point of doing this? This is already made. Examine. Uh. Probably comes from this part of the wharf. The wood is slightly eaten away, of course, but it still would have been fine if it weren't smashed. Interesting. Alrighty, then we will continue from there. Alright, so... Another bit of wood. It looks like hey, it's been eaten away. There's looks something like not something... right about this floorboard. It's different from the rest. Ah, uh, shit! Uh, it's not coming up. I'll never manage it barehanded. I need something to lever it with. Somebody replaced it recently. It looks like it's fixed pretty solidly in place. It's going to be tough to rip it out of here. Hold on, let's go see if we can try and find an item to rip up that floorboard with. And then maybe we can learn for something from there. I think that's the only other thing I really need to investigate heavily. Looks like the barrel's been broken for quite some time. The servant did mention something about a bro- Aha! There we are. We can use that. Looks like a bar from an old gate. This miserable old bar has been broken fairly recently. The edges are still clean. And the tip is blackened. Without analysis to the contrary, I put my money on cannon powder. Definitely going to take that bar. This It'll might just come help. in handy. Now, put it in your invisible pockets and... Sack of seeds. It's unopened. No one seems to have used any. Interesting. Alright, let's go see if that'll help us get that floorboard open and we'll see what's inside. Could be a very valuable a clue, an asset, when we take it on. We're getting somewhere, ladies and gentlemen. Getting somewhere. Alright, so use the rusty bar. That does it. Let's see what's hidden inside. Indeed. There's a book and also a bag. The Mysterium Cosmographicum. I know that book well. Mother used to read passages from it to me all the time. Maybe these are her secret what belongings. See, it's the same one as hers. For crying out loud, what's happened to you, Mother? Either she hid it there, or somebody hid it for her. Definitely. Let's look inside the bag. A little food, a few toiletries, a small key and some kind of black powder. We'll examine each item. Some fruit, a piece of bacon, and some bread. The fruit's still firm. The bread's a bit stale. From the smell, this food's been here roughly two days. And if it's rationed, there's enough left to last two more days. Interesting. Personal Shit. bar. Those are definitely my mother's things. I recognize her hairpins. This bag smells of her perfume. A piece of soap. Some oils and her powder puff. What does all this mean? Rusty key. An iron key completely rusted. Take the key. It know. might be useful for it something useful. for later. I hope Mother wasn't counting on it. Or maybe she was. Well, I made my decision. I'm first powder. I guess powder. Oh, the bag is covered in black powder. Okay, so the black powder is nothing really that bad. Right. Just in case, I'll take it all. I'll give it back to mother when I see her. You definitely try to put that wood back. out loud. Why did you hide supplies in the middle of nowhere, Mother? Maybe there were our supplies for us to here, find. You obviously feel like you're in danger. 
Alright, uh, wait. Can this key help us get in here? Use the iron key. There we go. Now, what other goodies can we find? Haven't even reached the manor. We're already finding goods. Hmm. This wharf is used as storage for a lot of barrels. Damn uh -huh. the broken barrel. What have we here? It's cannon powder. So why have the cannon powder? Oh, I cannot examine it. It's unusable now. I don't know what the person who left this barrel like this had in mind, but it's a waste. Or is it? Maybe we should examine this it. It's like a pistol case, but it's empty. Interesting. I don't know if this has anything to do with you, Mother, but if it does, at least now you're armed. Just like in my vision. Where is she? And none of it's telling me anything useful. Apparently, someone on this island Honey, has gone through a whole the lot of, of the trouble gods. to arm themselves. I think that's everything here, ladies and germs. Amber fragments. Each time you pick up four of them, you increase your maximum effort points. Excellent. Amber crystals. I'm glad I took the rusty key here. Good, good. Alright. Well, we've learned quite a bit of things. For one, she's been hiding equipment, either for us or for herself for future escape plans. Hiding in barrels that have seemed to be opened, and a few other whatnots. But all in all, it's a good day. I guess the only other thing left to do is to head ourselves up to the manor and then investigate Latin further. Inscription. And Nessis, mi fili quantilia produncia mundus regatur. Yeah, no, I, 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 I don't. <laughs> You've got me, fam. Good work, though, on those pronunciations. Picking up as much items as I can find. Some rope. Apparently no one's touched it for a good long time. I think we just got here, man. I don't think that's that much to be useful. Anyways. Alright, since I have nothing further to do, there is one thing I would like to check, though. Do I have any points? No further points. Talents or traits, though. Guess head up the stairs, guys. To the manor! How did Mortimer manage to build his manor at the top of a rocky outcrop? Magic. The gathering. I'm leaning toward the magic. Place is pretty though, I will give it that. I'm intrigued to find out what all the visions mean for her mother, why the Duchess is involved, why her hand is missing, and why she's been using barrels and trying to keep things here. So many questions that need answering. I'm sure they're swimming in his head as well. Hello. That's not ominous at all. Impressive. Ah, my son. I was looking for you. Were you? What can I do for you, Your Eminence? I wanted to ask you. You are the son of Sara de Vice, aren't you? You Today. see, your mother and I were supposed to meet here on this very spot. I was supposed to hand her a very important envelope. But I haven't seen her. If only Mother had told me why she was coming here. Anyway, I ought to take the envelope. It might have something to do with her disappearance. Listen, if it will help, you can always give it to me. 
During a confrontation, you have to go through several steps while being as persuasive as possible. Confronting has consequences on the rest of the story. No one hesitate to use your skills. Thank you, my son. So do this right. That in mind. I'd rather deal with her directly. Don't take it personally. Would you happen to know if your mother has arrived yet? Certainly, your eminence. Mother got here some time ago. I was hoping to find her when I arrived, but given the hour, she must be asleep by now. Right. I shall see her tomorrow, then. <laughs> Successful the step, way, guys. All I right. Where you knew my mother. Ah, uh, if you only knew my son. I hold your mother in the highest regard. She has rendered great service to the church, and her help is invaluable. I hope that you will follow in her footsteps. Mm -hmm. <sighs> only she had told me where she was headed. Nonetheless, our exchanges have always been discreet, and I should like them to remain as such. If your mother wishes to speak to you about us one day, I will not mind if she does so. That is commendable. But as we work together on a daily basis, it is surely just an oversight. I can Most tell you. Certain. Uh, you said you work together. What do you do exactly? Hmm. Mystical order. My mother and I belong to the same secret organization, the Golden Order, which I joined a few years ago. Mother trained me, and I assist in her research. In other words, you can trust me. <laughs> My child, you are telling a perfect stranger that you and your mother work for a secret society. It would seem that discretion mm. is not one of your specialities, my son. That. You will understand that it does not encourage me to put my trust in you. Shit! All the same, it bothers me to see you in a quandary, your eminence. Is there any other solution? Look, if it's of any help, you can always leave your envelope with me and I'll give it to her as soon as I see her. Uh, I uh, hesitate. Up till now, we have always dealt with her in person, and that has always been successful. Do you think I should give it to you? Ooh, ooh. Only you know that, Your Eminence. If you're asking me if you can trust me, or if I can keep a secret, I would answer yes. Absolutely. I understand. In truth, it all Successful depends step. on the nature of the contents of your letter. <laughs> it is a we gotta do this last one right, gentlemen. This list we can do this. We can do this. Ah, uh, if only you knew. It's a list of people that your mother must help. Listen to me, child. If I give you the letter, can you promise me before God that no one other than your mother will read it? Conversation, last step for the last step of. I swear by the Almighty God to honor the promise that no one but my mother shall cast her gaze upon your letter. Good. Listen, Six let's seven. stop there. Excellent. I'm going to tell you a secret, Monsieur de Riche. Your mother and I are organizing the escape of a large number of French priests who face a massacre organized by the accursed Republican tribunals. The church is literally being bled like a beast. Without your mother, hundreds of men of the cloth would have gone to the guillotine. She has made the services of your order available to us by organizing the priest's safe passage across the borders. Even if she does not share all our convictions, she always provided assistance. Young man, you can be proud to be her son. Be it only for her sake. Always respect your name. Here. The letter I spoke of. It includes a list of about 15 names ready for departure. Be quick. Remember to tell Sarah when you see her. That time is short. 
will do. Well played. I'll decide later when I'm alone whether to look at what it contains. Did hidden elements. New clues and items are hidden. Some of them will have an impact on the on your adventure. And I hesitate to look for them. Always check your surroundings, ladies and gentlemen. Always. But I would hate to cut things very, very short, but I do believe that is probably a good stopping point. We were able to best the conversation with the priest and be able to obtain the letters of the contents of um of what's inside. We will decide later on rather not to look at it. Leave me some comments down below if you think I should look at it or you think I should let's see you know oversee it and obey the almighty god but anyways um i will unfortunately have to cut this gameplay here short but as always like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video uh, guys uh hit the little bell icon to be notified of future gameplays of this one and a new gameplay that i hope to uh indulge you guys into much later and as always ladies and gentlemen i am your faithful companion darko sinner and i'll see you motherfuckers Later.